just come out of Midland Chandler's and uh, they've lightened the pocket with cash but I've just now bought all the stuff some pipe and the proper gas fittings and bag of bits and pieces all to do the gas connections so yeah here we are we just have a little walk about a sec down by the canal here this is down at Bronxton nice sunny day on the corner here. So yeah, I've been along here before, I mean, Cindy Cummings is where we came on our first narrowboat experience. We come along here from Rose's Narrowboat, a bit further up the road, or up the canal, should I say. I've just been into um, Shiny Clippers and had my hair cut, um, and they've made an absolutely great job of it. Uh, this is Ski, my hairdresser, um, and they've got a wonderful setup here. They've got the hairdressers, they've got the car wash, all totally professional, elite valeting. Um, so yeah, thumbs up to uh, all here at Shiny Clippers. Speak to you later. I just had a wander down to the canal here, see what's going on. A few boats about, see what's going on here. Oh, there's uh, some people coming out on their boat by the looks of it. Yeah. Oh, it's my uh, my neighbour Aaron. Looks like he's coming out for a test ride on his boat. He's got his in the water now. Well, we're back here, it's sunny, nice clear blue sky, but luckily there's a nice breeze blowing down through, so I've just got the boat opened up and cooled it off a bit. So yeah, here we are, four o'clock on uh, Wednesday. <laughs> start getting some jobs done. First job is I just got to cut a hole in the shelf so I can drop the oven in because the gas feed pipe on the oven sits comes down low so I'm just going to cut a hole then I can get that oven. Not that I'm putting the oven in but I need it all in to be able to fit stuff and if I put it in the hole it's out of the way. So yeah that's what we're on. So I'm just going to cut a hole here in the shelf.
Maybe we can try the oven in now. Yeah, there's the oven. In we go. Hopefully. Yeah, I just got to cut a little bit off the height of the legs on here. I'm going to get getting these bits done just to make sure they all fit. And yeah, just to trim a little, little whisker off the bottom of the feet. Vanity cabinet in, got a bit of adjustment door on the doors. Um, yeah, I'm just uh, putting the mirror up now, just thought I'd show you this little tip. So I've screwed it on, on the corners like that, and then I've got studs there to pop over. So if I ever need to take it down or glass gets broken, it'll just come off. A bit of work down the back of the boat here. I've just fitted that that was not fitted, but I've planed it all in so it fits that door. I've made this little cover up here, vent cover up to go on top of there, and I've just got the one out for the front there, outside on the bench, which we'll go and have a look at now. I do apologise for the sound quality, but I don't know what's Hello going there. Monday afternoon. Um, I'm still scrubbing down the back end of the boat here and what I'm doing here is I'm making a little pocket so that the, the table, when we don't want to use it, has got somewhere to go. What I've done, I've got a bit of cheap cooled carpet from the carpet shop yesterday. 
just bought a meter of it, it's only 12 quid and basically that's just made it a soft lining so that when that's going to go in there like so and just a little narrow pocket and then on this side I've got shelves to go in there and then we're going to put wicker baskets through there and the fridge obviously is above so yeah that's where that and of course I've got off cuts of carpet bloody Trevor said you could make me some shorts with those I could have some called Roy shorts so perhaps um, we might make Trevor some shorts later on but we'll see if we do we'll take some pictures he can pose as a model yeah I've got the um, that cupboard door up um, on the hinge you just got to have a catch fitted the shelves I sh haven't fixed them in yet they're only just pushed in on the battens so I'll get them painted I'll get a few coats of paint on there but yeah that's that little wall cupboard there and obviously there's the mirror there up so yeah it's all um all going along let's go on out the out to the workshop which is really nice out here i've um got me solar shower there been warming up today i'm gonna have to move that back into the sun because it's gone behind the tree i'll take it down the back end of the boat um yeah here we are all nicely spread out um yeah, this should come out the clamps now. Um, yeah, that's the little grill for the for the back there. Speak to you all later. Just stopped. I've had my first uh, shower. I had my old camp shower out today. I didn't get it that warm because it had only arrived today about lunchtime. But uh, it was warm enough to have a shower with anyway. So. Uh, yeah, I just put the bit of ball down there, kept my pants on and done the shower. Really nice, feel really refreshed. So get filled up, ready for the morning for tomorrow's. Good morning everybody. Um, as you can see I've been cracking on. These I've only got the tops just sat in there temporary because I've got to do a few adjustments somewhere, the exact position of them. But um, I'm basically working down the back end of the boat here now. Um, I've got that door on that's already hinged on I'm just going to chop the hinges out down there for this door trouble is the bloody older you get it's harder getting down on your bloody hands and knees and chopping the hinges out but uh, there we go that's just how it is but yeah we're um, cracking on so yeah bit of a mess but then I make a mess tonight but then it all comes good in the end good morning everybody Saturday morning um, I'm working down here on the back steps. I've got coming on quite well. There's the bottom step on. That's the second step. And that hinges back up there. It's got a little bit shaved off it. And now I'm just working on the top step, which I've got on the bench here because I've got to make these little feet that basically they'll hinge there so that when you fold the step down you hinge the legs out and that supports this top step um, so yeah and these little feet they'll just locate i've chopped a couple of holes out in the bottom step and that'll just locate them in there so yeah that's where we're at today well, special moment here i've now got the steps in so i'm gonna see if they work properly for the first time off we go Perfect. We've got the little legs on there now. They fold back like so. That one then folds up like so. And that one, I've just got to cut the hole in the bottom just to pick it up, and that will sit in the back there out of the way. So, yeah, it all seems to be working tickety boo. I'm pleased with that. I had to make it up as I went along, but uh, there we go, another little job done. Trevor's got his own way, he's got his shorts, he's well kitted out. He's got a little top cover as well, like a little cloak, 
Uh, the only thing is, he said they're a bit short. I said, well, they're bloody shorts, aren't they? I said, you know, I said, I've got enough leftovers to make your long trousers. You're having shorts. He said, but they're short. I said, well, yeah, that's it, because you're, you're such a tall, lanky person. Or lanky tripod. So anyway, he's never seemed bloody happy, but there he is, all done. But he said, you're going to have to hold the camera now, because otherwise I won't be able to swan about and people won't be able to see me. So I don't know what it's coming to, but there we Here go. We have the... Uh little stash pot for the table to go in there. I'm going to have to do a little slot up the side here, I think, so I've got something to actually pull it out with, because if I push it right in, I won't get it out. But, um, yeah, that works a treat. As I say, I've got a bit of carpet in there to just to save it getting all scratched. So, yeah, we're happy with that. On to the next job. Well, this is the first video with Trevor with his shorts on. Um, anyway, I've just now trimming the top in, doing the end panel here because I want to get the work topple set up and in place now, exactly where it's going to go. So I'm just trimming this panel to suit. Just, uh, I'm stopping down the end of the boat here now because I've got these are all basically in where they want to be. Got the shells into the baskets, the tray space, not the tray space, the, the um, table space works. Um, oven's all in where it wants to go because I'm hand painting all this. This will have to come out anyway, like, but uh, basically, I've got the tops are they're, they're fitted in where they're going to go, but they're not actually fixed. Because uh, I've obviously got to make the cabinets to go underneath yet, yeah, so I'll be making all them myself. No, there's no chipboard going in here at all in this boat. Um, so, yeah, there we are. So I'm going to leave it down this end of the boat now. And uh, we'll get up the other end here. Um, and... Uh, yeah, we're going to get this little wardrobe covered up in the corner there and the little low covered up done down there. So there we are, speak to you later. Well, I've had some parcels arrive. I've just got the open one and that's the wicker baskets. They're all in in their place now. Got another box out there, that's the uh, pull out waste bin. Um, yeah, there we go. Another little bit done. Hello there. Well, Wednesday today. I'm down the front end of the boat here. As you can see, it's all starting to take shape there now. We've got the corner cabinet in and the corner wardrobe in. And I'm just working on the step down there. But all of this stuff, basically, that's going down the end here, without too much hassle, I can unscrew it and take it all out in case we need to get to the water tank 
either end because that end is where it comes out of the ball and that this side over is where it fills up um, so yeah if I ever need to get in there these cabinets will come out um, yeah I'm glad you're all enjoying the video that Cindy put out this morning thank you for your comments truly noted speak to you all quite mad we've got bright sunshine and yet it's really trying hard to rain now so I'm going to just cover my stuff up outside just in case it chucks it down but not very cloudy but it's raining on my boat anyway good morning um getting on well again this morning friday morning there's a skirting radiator in um got the cupboards all formed up what i'm doing now i'm just uh drilling some holes here to put the uh usb charging point in and some little lights in um i'll show you that when i've done well we've got the lights and the usb points in now i've also got the 240 socket there for the Cindy's hair dryer and straightener use because uh, we've got a little um, chest of drawers going in there freestanding a nice little mirror goes on the top uh, so the socket would be a bit hidden out of the way which is good um, I'm just making a little box in now because I've had to fit it on the side of the wardrobe here and I'm just making a little box in to cover those cables up I'm just doing all the little bitting and bobbing today I'm um, just getting bits finished off just doing a door stops up inside all the doors um, yeah we're getting on well yeah good afternoon Friday afternoon I've just come and sat under here in the shade because I've got trees here where I've got my bench in my van and that and the old boat's over there um, yeah, I've come out here to have um, a cup of tea and a slice of cake because we haven't really done the cake slot for a while have we but anyway special feature on the chopping board today we've got um, walnut cake from Rowan's Hill which is basically Lidl's um, not a lot of money under a quid um, so yeah we're going to give the uh, walnut cake a try um, but yeah thank you I'm glad that you've been enjoying the, the latest video so far um, I'm cracking on with it well Cindy's coming up in the morning so we've got a you know royalty inspection so a bit of a clean up both the boat and myself and uh, anyway let's get back to this cake in hand um, I'll put the camera down and we'll cut it and see what it's like and come back anyway, yeah the uh, walnut cake's quite nice it's um, got quite plenty of walnuts in it as you can see I've got the old BBC very dirty t-shirt on um, but that'll be going back to Cindy for the wash bin I expect um, so yeah, for under a quid, cheap bit of cake, it's not bad, Rowan's Hill from Lidl. Yeah, there's the, uh, one of the, that's showing, that will close up when the boat cools down tonight, that joint will close down. Um, that's where the boat expands and contracts, but that's just how it is, but it's no big deal really. Um, you can see a little bit, get a little bit here on the, the lining of the roof hatch as well, that will close up. But. Don't worry. Yeah, they're off on the maiden voyage to give it the shakedown. Um, Aaron's been my neighbour up in the yard since uh, I got here. He's just finished refurbishing his boat and they're off to give it a couple of days tryout. And then uh, they got their first rental on it next weekend. So yeah, they're just doing it as a hire boat. Proxy, we're at Foxton Locks, aren't we? We've just walked down from the from where the boat is along the canal and come down here and have a nice drink of orange juice and lemonade. And we've got a jazz band playing on over there. So yes, Foxton Locks. Little dog in the window there looking for Roxy. A little bark at. 